been massaging or mixing the solution with the fruits. And now we're going to set it for 15 minutes. So we're gonna set a timer and put 15 minutes in each. Okay, so we did, we're done with the filters. We're, make, we're done making those. And then we read that we had to, in the end, now we just noticed that we had to, this would take two hours to freeze, at least three hours. So, but it said um, 15 milliliters of this, and we're going to freeze it. So we got our ice cream tray, and we're going to fill this up. Fill this up and put it into this tray. 10, because we have 10 cups. After uh, 15 minutes, this bag, we're going to pour the strawberry in the, in the cups where they belong and the banana into there where they belong. So we're going to filter it. So here is strawberry number one. We're going to filter it now. See? It looks like blood. It does, kinda. But it's, it's blood. strawberry. It's strawberry. It looks like blood. Okay, here's number one. Number one, strawberry. Now what's that one? What number, color is that? Number what? two. Now what color is it? It's gonna be red. Number two, strawberry. Okay, we're gonna do the same thing, pouring it in. This is just getting the pulp out. And after we drain all of these, we can throw these bags in the trash. So those are two, those are strawberries. Okay, number three. Okay, now that we're done putting all there, we're going to filter it. So, we're going to squeeze it like this. This is like, you have to take the pulp out, out of the fruits. But not, you can't spread it too hard, or the bag might pop the filter. So here's number one, we're squeezing it out. To get you're the squeezing it out? Mm -hmm. Oh, how are you squeezing it out? Yep. I want to try it too. Okay. Number two. You guys gonna take the bag out? Gotta take it out? No, I just need the liquid, the content.
do our banana. We're going to observe the changes in our fruits. You can see. Describe how each cup looks. Well, each cup is, has bubbles inside. So that's one thing that's the same about it. There's one cup is lighter and one cup is darker. And they're both different colors. And also, it used to be a solid because the strawberry and the banana were real they're real hard it was a solid and then after we did all the things now it's a liquid and it's much finer than we got it we took all the pulp out we crushed it everything so now that's something that has changed we're done observing we're going to put our, our, our alcohol inside and we're going to put 15 millimeters in each cup and then we're going to see what happens this is the it's a, it's propyl alcohol and this is not the ideal color because the store didn't have any other the clear ones so this has been in the freezer for three hours and it's not frozen but it is cold ice cold so now we're going to put 15 milliliters in each cup it's gonna be a little bit tricky but okay we're gonna do that I'm trying to get every single thing out okay this is gonna be much easier we already measured each um, each little box and it should be 15 milliliters each So now that we're done putting that 15 milliliters in each cup, we're going to set it for two hours and see what the results will be. The, yes, their color has changed, but we, there's no clear one that was here. So we're going to see what happens in two hours to these. So 
they're all different. Especially the strawberries. One is one is darker and one is lighter on the strawberry side. So that one is darker and this is lighter. It, which looks like looks green, but you can tell the difference. And the strawberries are more active than the bananas. The banana does, does, isn't really showing anything. But the strawberries, they have some things in there. And there are some bubbles that are starting. So that one looks like, looks like tea. But no, you can't drink it. Because it has that. You can see the bubbles in there. Okay, well, we're gonna see what it looks like in two hours. Here's the result of our DNA extraction for strawberry. It's cup, it has something. After three hours, three hours actually and we are about to make sure the stuff Okay, now we're going to measure our cups. So it's um, the banana number one. If you can see, it's, it's kind of hard to tell, but this is just how you measure it. But the point of this is that the DNA fills how many squares. That's how much it is. That's why they're squares. Here's the strawberries. And it's kind of really hard to tell. So I would say I think it fills right. squares. Five times four would be twenty. What was that for? It's five by five. That, um, anyways, three, that's four, the DNA. Four, four by four by five. That one. That's really cold, though. You can see. It. The, you can see the this DNA. One is really in here, but there's plenty over here. The lights not good. Blur. How many on that? This one's really hard to tell. We are trying to measure how much square for the DNA the result is, but it's so hard to tell. Or maybe we can do this. Because of the glary. Okay. Um, it looks like... So it feels... Oh, actually, you can see it better. It looks like it feels 3 by... Uh, five by three, or, or no, five by four, mm -hmm. or maybe more than that. Just a few extra. You can see better than that. All right, so don't put it above. Put it under so you can tell which how much it is. Actually. This one is there's plenty in here. Okay, and then we're gonna you measure this one. Okay, that looks good. That fills the whole thing in there. In yeah. The bottom. How many squares? Mm. So yeah, I this, think this strawberry right here because this one. I think that so the banana has more DNA than the strawberries. And in the book, that's what it says. And it just mm -hmm. wants us to see. So that actually fills four blocks right there. Mm -hmm. See, that's the DNA right there, the thing that you can see inside. So, yeah. That's the result. Strawberry versus banana. 
DNA extraction. Banana win. More DNA. Here's the result of our experiment. The banana and the strawberry. And the banana has more DNA than the strawberries. As it says in our book. Thank you guys for watching this video. And like and subscribe to Kai Kate Journey. Bye!